Question 4. Draw the reflection of the shady shape in the mirror line. As soon as you see the words reflection and mirror, you should be thinking about getting yourself a mirror and getting yourself some tracing paper. Okay. One way of doing this would be just simply to put the mirror on the shape, look into the mirror. Whatever you see inside the mirror is what you need to draw on the other side of the shape because you are seeing the reflection inside the mirror and that's what you need to draw. The second way of doing it would be to measure using your ruler the distances from each corner to the mirror line. So for example, if you measure the distance from this corner to the mirror line and then measure straight across on the other side, you'll get to that corner. Then measure the distance from this corner to the mirror line. That's quite a bit longer. Measure the same distance again on the other side and you'll get to that corner. Measure this distance to the mirror line and then do the same again on the other side and you'll get to there. And the only one we haven't talked about is this corner here which is touching the mirror line. When you reflect that corner it is still touching the mirror line. All you have to do then is very carefully join your corners up. Obviously, you would do this with a ruler because if you didn't do it with a ruler, you may actually lose some marks. So make sure you do it with a ruler so it does say to do it there. The third way you could have done this was to use tracing paper. Now, if you get your tracing paper, trace the original shape, which is the one in grey, trace the mirror line and then flip it over. It's got to be flipped. It cannot be rotated. If you rotate it, it won't work. It's got to be flipped over. So the whole piece of paper is going to be turned over onto the back. So once you flip it over, you will get this shape. And you place it on the mirror line. And where you placed it is where you need to draw the reflected shape. So there's three ways of doing it. Way number one is to use the mirror. Way number two is to measure the distances from each corner to the mirror line and repeat the same distance on the other side. And way number three is to trace the shape, flip the paper over onto the back, place it back over the mirror line, and then redraw the new shape. Whichever way you do it, always check your answer using the mirror.